Hey everyone, welcome back to my Python tutorial. In this tutorial, I am going to show you how to create a beautiful long exposure from a video using Python. Before proceeding further, please be sure to drop a like on this video and subscribe to my channel for more such tutorials. So, without any further ado, let's jump into the tutorial. First, we will install the CV2 library. Open terminal window and type pip install. Open CV Python. Now, open your IDE. Then, you are good to follow along. Import the CV2 library. Now, create an args dictionary. Create a key, named input, with the path of the input video, as its value. Similarly, create an output key, with the output directory of the image, as its value. Be sure to include the PNG extension, along with the file name. Declare three variables, raverage, gAverage, and bAverage, with their default values set to none. These variables will contain the computed average values for the RGB channels, of each frame of the video. Declare a total variable, with its default value set to zero. Let's read the input video from the provided path. We will use CV2's video capture function for this. Let's use a while true loop, to loop over the frames of the video file. Grab the frame, using read method of vid object. Since it returns a tuple of a boolean, and the image, we will unpack it, into ret, and frame variables. Use an if condition, to check if the boolean is false. If it is false, we can break out of the while loop, since we have reached the end of file. Increment the value of total variable by 1. Now, we will split the frame into its BGR channels, using CV2's split function. Use the asType method, to convert the frame into array of floats. If our average is none, we will initialize the three variables, with their respective channel arrays. Else, we will, we will calculate the weighted average of each frame. We will use CV2's accumulate weighted function for this. 
for the R average, pass the red channel array to it, as source. Pass the R average as accumulator. We will set the weight of the image to, reciprocal of total variable. Repeat the same steps for green, and blue channels. Now, we will merge the three channels, into an image, using CV2's merge function. Be sure to use as type method, to convert the array from float, to 8-bit unsigned integer format. Let's save this image to the given output path, from UGS dictionary. Use vidobjects release method, to close the video file. So, our program is ready. I will save, and run it. For best results, I recommend to use a 15 to 20 seconds duration clip, with fixed camera angle. As you can see, the program is working as expected. So, that's all for today. Hope you would have enjoyed the tutorial. Please be sure, to drop a like on this video, and subscribe to my channel, for more such tutorials. I will meet you next time, till then, good luck, and peace.